Welcome Jesus. to Standing for Jesus Ministries. Stand up for Jesus. I'm gonna stand up and praise His name. I'm gonna stand up for Jesus. Oh, I'm so glad He died for me. And now, thanks to Him, I've been set free. I'm gonna stand up for Jesus. I'm gonna Stand up for Jesus. I'm gonna stand up and praise His name. I'm gonna stand up for Jesus. And now, let us hear the Word of God. Standing for Jesus Ministries is brought to you in part by the following. McDowell Professional Pharmacy. Call 377-1088. Lenny Hall Income Tax and Accounting. Call 377-2633. And by Nelson Fraser Funeral Homes. With offices in Martin and Hyman. Call 285-5155.
opportunity again to come into your house. We've had we've kind of programs kind of put on hold there a little bit and stuff. But God has blessed us that we could come back. Maybe for a few months or two we're going to be uh, on the second and fourth Sunday of each month for just a couple months maybe. But You know the devil tries to defeat us in every way. Thanks be to God. I know that I'm not just a winner when I leave this life. I'm going to be a winner in this life too. Because Jesus said he'd never leave us, never forsake us. And we begin to think about when we get back into the service, we thank God for a song. We thank God for uh, the prayer requests that are still been coming in. And we just prayed over them. And we know God answers prayers. Amen. We thought about the message today that, listen, all I could think about today was how the world is and how that the world today is evil everywhere you look. I mean, nobody wants any good anymore. Nobody wants to see anything good. Nobody hardly talks about anything good anymore. You turn the TV news on and everything is bad, Brother Mikey. And you all hear bad news, but... Listen, I want to tell you, in the midst of all the things that's going on in the world, there is good news, my friend. And that news is Jesus, our Lord and Savior. Amen. That news is something. Listen, special. That news is that there is one that loves you. I listen more than you could ever imagine, my friend. I, I that there is one that died for you, my friend, and he uh, allowed himself to be nailed between the, uh, an old rugged cross between the heavens and the earth. I, I listen that he gave his life for you and I that we might have eternal life. I, I listen, now that's good news, my friend. I, no matter how hard things seem to get in this life, I, I listen, we got a better than a friend in Jesus. I, I listen, he's more than a friend. I, I listen, he'll be your best friend. I, I listen, we're going to read some scriptures here in a minute, baby. I, I listen, but we know that the Bible talks about the days. I, I listen, I believe we're living in them, Brother Mikey. I, I listen, I, I people could care less whether you live or die. I, I people don't I, I listen like I, I listen hearing things anymore. I, I, you tell them about Jesus anymore, and they say, I, I listen, while well, you're trying to force something on people. I, uh, that's not the way God works, my friend. Uh, he don't force nothing on nobody. Uh, but make no mistake about it, my friend. One day after a while, uh, uh, listen, you're going to realize. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, those people told me the truth. Uh, uh, that little fat preacher told me the truth. Uh, uh, listen, those people carrying the testimony, there's something about that. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, one day because people, uh, uh, listen, it's not that you laugh at God's children. Uh, uh, listen, uh, I want you to know uh, uh, when God gets a hold of you, you know you've got something. Huh? Uh, listen, it don't matter what's being said about you. Huh? Uh, listen, because the Bible says huh? uh, Jesus said they persecuted me they're going to persecute you. Huh? Uh, listen, so it's going to happen. Huh? Uh, listen, but I want to tell you something, child of God. Huh? Uh, you hold on huh? uh, with everything you've got huh? uh, because the time is coming. Huh? Uh, listen, huh? uh, that the eastern sky is going to split. Huh? Uh, listen, and Jesus is going to step out on the clouds of glory. Huh? Uh, listen, it could be this very day, my friend. Uh, listen, uh, it could be any time. Uh, listen, I know they try to preach that this and that has to happen, uh, but the only thing I know to tell you is what the Word of God says. Uh, uh, he says today is the day of salvation. Uh, uh, listen, you got no promise, my friend, that you'll draw the next breath. Uh, uh, listen, you got no promise of sin another day. Uh, uh, listen, but you know what? Uh, when Jesus is in your life, you've got more of that. you got a promise, all right? Uh, you got a promise. Uh, uh, listen, uh, we've always said uh, uh, mom and dad can go to the graveside with you. Uh, uh, listen, uh, our families can go to the graveside with us, but Jesus, uh, uh, listen, we'll get uh, on the other side with us. Uh, amen. Uh, when this life is over, uh, uh, listen, this ain't it, my friend. Uh, a lot of people don't realize, uh, but we just begin to live. Uh, uh, listen, when we leave this old 
a sinful world. Amen. We're going to try to read just a little bit. The Bible says in 1 Thessalonians in the 5th chapter, it says, But of the times and the seasons, brethren, you have no need that I write unto you. For yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman, and that with child, and they shall not escape. But be ye, brethren, are not of darkness, and that day should overtake you as a thief. Ye are all the children of light. Listen, of that day ye are not of the night, nor of darkness. Therefore let us not sleep, as do others, but let us watch and be sober. For they which sleep, sleep in the night, and they which be drunken are drunken in the night. And let us not, let us who are of the day be sober, putting on a breastplate of faith and love for the hope of salvation. Helmet and the hope of salvation. Amen. Now listen, I'm going to read one more scripture, and I want you to listen. For God hath not appointed us to wrath, but to obtain salvation by our Lord Jesus Christ. See, now you realize, my friend, God don't leave us in darkness. He tells us these things are coming upon the earth. Listen, he tells us that things are coming. People's love will wax cold, Brother Mikey. Listen, he said, because, listen, iniquity abounds. Sin abounds everywhere, my friend. Listen, everything from homosexual sins. Listen, to people are just, listen, they don't know there's no standard. Listen, that people go by anymore on what's good and what's bad. But I'm going to tell you something. God had set a standard. Standard for you and I to go by. Listen, and we're not making to heaven except we accept Jesus as Lord and Savior. That's our standard to make it to heaven. Listen, then we need to trust Him. Listen, we need to realize that without Him we are nothing, but through Him we can do all things. I believe it's in Paul's writing. He said, "I can do all things." For the mighty through Christ who strengthens me. Listen, I love. Listen. I'm my life. Uh, listen. Uh, you say, well, preacher, what are you talking about? Uh, I love my life. Uh, listen. Uh, they say it's miserable here. Uh, listen. We worry about bills. Uh, listen. We have to worry about our health. Uh, listen. All these things. Uh, but there's coming one day after a while. Uh, listen. We won't have to worry about that. Uh, that's why I love my life. Uh, listen. I love my life because I am a child of God. Uh, listen. He takes care of me here. Uh, listen. Uh, but uh, greater than that. He's going to take me one day home after a while. The same Jesus. Listen, they were in the Bible one time, Brother Mikey. Listen, that they told him. Listen, that he was seeing among 500 people that saw Jesus taken up into the clouds of glory. Listen, he said, I will be back. Listen, they began to look up into the sky and the angels appeared unto him. Listen, unto them that day and said, you may have Galilee, why are you standing here gazing? Uh, listen, uh, for the same Jesus that has been taken away from you today, uh, he's coming back in like manner. Uh, listen, so make no mistake about it. Uh, them skies are going to split open one day, uh, and Jesus is going to step forth. Uh, listen, not to be spit up on again, uh, not to be tried. Uh, listen, uh, not to have people call him, uh, listen, the devil. Uh, listen, but he's stepping out as King of Kings uh, and Lord of Lord. And listen, he's going to sow his church and he's going to take us home one day after a while to be with him. Listen, that's what keeps me excited in this life. Now the Bible says to be prayer. Be absent from this old body, Brother Mikey, is to be present with God. Amen. Oh, brother, the spirit will flow sometimes. Listen, you feel like you're, oh, you can't just handle any more of your body. Listen, we just get a little taste of how good God is now. Listen, there's coming a time, my friend. Listen, it's going to be, oh, so glorious. Listen, we're just getting a taste of it. Listen, the Bible says, listen, that we'll have a body. Body, my friend, like it unto Jesus. Uh, listen, that I feel no more pain. Uh, listen, no more tears. Uh, for God Himself will wipe away every.
every tear. Uh, listen, that rolls out a man's eyes. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, the time and season is here. Uh, uh, listen, uh, I want you to know uh, Ecclesiastes says, uh, uh, listen, that there's a purpose for everything that happens under the sun. Uh, uh, listen, I want you to know, uh, uh, listen, if you're watching this right now uh, and you're lost and all done, uh, uh, there's a purpose for it, my friend. Make no mistake about it. Uh, because Jesus is saying, come on to me. Uh, all you that labor and heavy laden. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, oh, and people say, well, that applies to the church, the ones that's working and laboring. Uh, uh, listen, I got news for you, my friend. Uh, uh, you labor in this old world, whether you're laboring for God uh, or whether you're laboring for the devil. Uh, uh, Jesus said, choose you this day whom you're going to serve. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, don't you want to go home one day? Uh, uh, listen to a place that Jesus has got prepared for us. Uh, uh, listen, I do. Uh, I can't wait to go. Uh, but listen, I know. Uh, I got to leave this old world one day after a while. <laughs> I may be standing uh, when the rapture comes, uh, when Jesus decides to call his children home. Uh, I may be standing in a pulpit. Oh, wouldn't that be glorious? Uh, I may be laying in my bed. Uh, listen, then again, I may go by the way of the grave. Uh, listen, before that day. Uh, listen, but it don't matter. Uh, to be absent from this body uh, is to be present with the Lord. Uh, listen, I want to tell you some of the times and seasons, brother. Uh, listen, Bible says there'd come a great falling away. Uh, uh, listen, there would be them. Uh, uh, listen, a famine in the land. Uh, uh, Brother Mikey of hearing of the word of God. Uh, uh, these people today uh, uh, that'll let you uh, pat you on the back and say this is all right. Uh, uh, listen, when God says it ain't. Amen. Uh, uh, listen, these people today, I want you to know that the word is being preached. Uh, uh, listen, but there's also some garbage being preached. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, people telling you. Uh, uh, listen, uh, on news programs and all this stuff that there are other ways to heaven. Uh, listen, uh, but my God says uh, that he is a jealous God. Uh, uh, listen, uh, and there is no other way to heaven except that through and by uh, uh, the precious blood of Jesus. Uh, if we step over the blood of Jesus, uh, the Bible says uh, uh, listen, we cannot be saved. Uh, amen. Uh, I don't care how much we try. Uh, I don't care how much we try with our emotions. Uh, uh, listen, uh, our emotions get carried away with us so much we try it in a bottle somewhere. Uh, uh, listen, old pill bottle, uh, an alcoholic bottle. Uh, uh, listen, we get, uh, uh, listen, uh, our mind, people get their minds plastered to try to forget about things. Uh, uh, listen, but I want to tell you something about the great, uh, how you forget about things. Uh, put it in Jesus' arms. Uh, amen. Jesus said he would take your sins and cast them as far as the east is to the west, uh, uh, never to be brought before you again. Uh, and he forgets it. Uh, he starts you over with a new life, Brother Mikey. Uh, uh, listen, he said, Sends you down a path. Uh, listen, he says, I'll never leave you and I'll never forsake you. Uh, listen, once you start walking that walk uh, and talking that talk, you say, Well, preacher, I just can't live the life. Uh, listen, Jesus said through and by him, uh, you can do all things. Uh, listen, uh, I've failed the Lord many a time. Uh, listen, but I know where to go to. Uh, listen, because he's, uh, uh, listen, uh, he's my Lord and Savior. Uh, listen, uh, the Bible says, uh, he said, one writer said, I write unto you little children that you sin not. But if you sin, you have an advocate with the Father. Now listen, I want you to know, listen, today is the day of salvation. I'd hate to think what we might have to face tomorrow, Brother Mikey. But the times and seasons we ready here to you. Now listen, I don't, he says, I don't need to write unto you. He's talking to the church here. Now listen, he says, I don't need to write unto you because you know what's coming. Uh, you know these people. Uh, you know the times of trouble. Uh, uh, listen, uh, over in Revelation, it talks about the stars of falling from heaven, Brother Mikey. Uh, uh, listen, uh, and this uh, crushing thing. Uh, it talks about the waters being poisoned. Uh, uh, listen, you don't want to be here for that. Uh, uh, listen, my friend, you can escape the wrath uh, because Jesus said he's the way, the truth, and the life. Uh, uh, listen, there are going to be things coming. Uh, uh, listen, our own government today... Uh, our own government today, uh, listen, will recognize every other religion before they will. Uh, listen, 
Christianity. And that's sad, but it's true. Listen, I want you to know, my friend, listen, that Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. And the devil's right now probably telling you, a lost person, listen, that you might have plenty of time. The devil might be telling you right at this moment, listen, that if you're young, listen, that you can just wait a little while. But Jesus said, today is the day of salvation. Listen, when you hear his voice, listen, knocking at your heart. Listen, when you hear, listen, something down inside you saying, listen, I need to be a better man, woman, or child. Listen, when God starts dealing with that heart, listen, I want you to know, listen, that is God. How do I know? Because the devil will tell you a lie. The devil will tell you the complete opposite. The devil will tell you you've got plenty of time. The devil will tell you, listen, that Jesus ain't the only way. The devil will tell you, wait a while. But Jesus said that he stayed with outstretched arms. Say, come on to me. Uh, listen, he is the way, the truth, and the life. The uh, Bible says if we try to climb up some other way, uh, we're the same as a thief and a robber. Uh, uh, listen, and the thief and robber is not going to enter into the kingdom of heaven, Brother Mikey. Uh, uh, listen, he said... Uh, that if you come to him, you must first believe that he is. Why is it so hard for people to believe that Jesus came and died for them? Why is it so hard, my friend, for people to understand? Listen, that we are. Listen, we're born into sin, oh sinful flesh. Listen, because of Adam's fall, but because Jesus was willing to do the Father's will, and he came down. Listen, and he allowed himself to die on that old rugged tree. Uh, listen, he shed that blood uh, that you and I uh, could go free. Uh, listen, that you and I, uh, listen, sins can be covered under the blood uh, of the land. Uh, listen, uh, and we start on a new journey. Uh, listen, uh, of a lot of people today, uh, listen, they're holding on to something in your life. Uh, you got something in your life you're holding on to. Uh, what is it, my friend? Uh, Jesus can take it away. Uh, listen, he said he's mighty to the pulling down of strongholds. Uh, Amen. He can pull down any stronghold uh, that might be in your life. What is it? Alcohol? Uh, drugs? Uh, what is it? Uh, lust? Uh, pride? Uh, listen, uh, Jesus can take care of all of it, Brother Mikey. Uh, and he promised that he would. Uh, listen, but we got to seek him with our whole heart. Uh, amen. Uh, he don't want to be second best in your life. He wants to be uh, your Lord and Savior. Uh, he wants to be, uh, and he will be, my friend, uh, the best friend that you ever had if you'll turn it over to him amen now listen now I want you to know God didn't appoint us listen to die listen no be listen people don't understand they think well God does this and God does that listen I want you to know God makes a way of escape that's what he does listen well God allows these things to happen on this world listen I want you to know and the Bible says how can he though how can the potter say, how can the clay say to the potter, how's you made me this? He's God, and he's given us a way of escape. And if we don't take it, we're never going to make heaven our home. Amen. I want to give you something here right now on this program. Everybody calls it an invitation or an altar call. Listen, but Jesus started this thing back when he hung between the heavens and the earth. Listen. He told his disciples to go and preach the gospel to every living creature. And them that are saved and baptized shall be saved. Amen. And that's what we're trying to tell you is there is a better way. While they're playing this song, wherever you might be, listen in your home. Listen, you may be laying in bed watching this. You might be sitting there in a bed lounge chair. Listen, I want you to know, lost person, Jesus loves you enough that he gave his only begotten son. Listen, that if you believe in him, you don't have to perish in this world. You don't have to perish in the world to come. Listen, you know the other line. We got two sides here that we're looking at. Amen. The Bible says that death is separation from God. You know that? Eternal death. Listen, but I want you to know uh, listen, when you got God in your heart, listen, the Bible says you receive peace. 
All I can remember, I, when I first gave my life to the Lord, I had so much peace. Didn't really understand it all. I, and I still don't. I, but I know God is God. And I know he's sitting on the throne. And I know that Jesus is standing right by his side. I, I listen, I, I'll make an intercession for me when I make a mistake. I, I listen, he's there right now. I, I listen, I, I'm sending out right now. You know what Jesus said? No man comes to the Father except through and by him. That's why he died for you. Listen, that you might have life and have it more abundantly. Brother Mikey, this old world today, listen, I want you to know, listen, this old world today can care less. And we should care less too because the Bible says to come out from among the world and be a separate people. Amen. We have to live in this old world. But listen, we don't have to be partakers of the sins of the world. Amen. Jesus said, listen, I go away and I will prepare a place for you and I will come back. He made you that promise. Listen, he wants you to trust him, my friend. He wants you to give him a listen. A lot of people preach in church, well, a listen. Try God. Listen, I've said it myself many a time. Try the Lord and see if he ain't good. Amen. But I want you to know, listen, once you try him, you don't want to let him go. Listen, he's the only thing that makes sense to me in this world. Listen, he's the only thing that's ever helped me through every trial I've had. And the main thing is, I know when it's so peaceful to lay down at night upon my pillow, lay my head down on my pillow, and know that if I died in my sleep, heaven would be my home. Oh, it's the greatest joy ever was to know that down deep inside. There's more joy than listening and serving God. Listen, people, I want to say this in closing. You think that it's wonderful to get high. You think that it's wonderful to listen to the feeling you get. Well, I'm going to tell you something. I can tell you of a feeling that the Lord will put down inside you that'll make you shout. It'll make you feel so good. Now listen, you would ever wondered why you ever fooled with an old truck. Jesus loves you. We love you. We hope and pray, listen, that you give your heart to the Lord. But listen, keep praying for this program. Oh, we got started back here. We had to skip a few programs. But listen, I want you to know the devil's already defeated. And if you're lost and undone and you want to defeat the devil, you listen to these words. Jesus said, except you be born again, you'll not see what heaven looks like. He told Nicodemus, except a man be born again. Nicodemus said, how can a man be born when he's already old? He said, you're looking at it fleshly, Nicodemus. He said, that which is flesh is flesh, and that which is spirit is spirit. How do you be born of the spirit? Give in to the Lord and say, God, come into my life. Save me. Forgive me. And you try God and see if he ain't good. And he'll save you. He will lead you. He will guide you into all righteousness. That I promise according to the word of God. But now, a lot of people will start and they say, well, I tried. God won't leave you, my friend. I guarantee it. I hope and pray we said something to help somebody. And I thank God for the privilege to come back into your home, you that watch this, and you keep praying for us and send in your prayer request. Remember, for a few couple months at least, we're going to be just on the second Sunday and the fourth Sunday. So keep praying for us. God bless you.